support of these issues? Uh, very, very. You know, we just have to have five guys on the same page. And that, yeah, obviously, that comes with time. But you know, tonight was tonight was pretty disappointing. Um, but you know, we obviously didn't play another day. There's only game three, and um, this team's going to get so much better. Is it more disappointing that it was the home opener? Um, yeah, a little bit. You know, obviously, you never want to you know lose on the home home opener, but. You know this, uh, which we thought you know could be a very winnable game for us. We um, thought it was a lack of uh, communication, a little bit of lack of effort. It was disappointing. What changed after the first quarter? Um, I thought we got a little bit selfish at times, um, offensively and defensively. You know, uh, um, you know, almost not helping defensively because then you know my man would, if I help, my man might get a shot. You know, and uh, you know that goes for that goes for the whole team. And offensively, I thought we took a couple shot questionable shots and. Um, yeah. we got we got time to get better at this. What makes Trey so tough? Um, that he's live from twenty five feet. You know he's uh, you know he's he's it's almost like that Steph Curry mold. You know obviously you know you got to guard him as soon as he cross half, crosses half court and you know he's he's uh, he's a lot better playmaker than I had originally thought. So he's impressive tonight. We had a chance to watch the first two and then tonight. What does it look like to you? Transition was the first two. Um, I didn't. I haven't gotten to see their transition points tonight, but for the most part, I thought we did an all right job um, tonight. Obviously, offensive rebound hurt us, and then um, switching. You know, there was no no communication. You know, that was probably I wasn't out there the first two games, so I communicated. I can only speak on tonight, but tonight was communication. How did it feel to get back out on the court? Felt great. Um, it felt great. I'm still uh, still working on getting. So working on getting a little pop back in my legs and, and jumping and stuff. I missed a couple bunnies around the rim that are normally dunk. So, um, so still got to get a little bounce back, and but I'll be fine. All great. Good. I mean, communication is obviously a big key in a switching mm -hmm. scheme. So how is it that after working on it all preseason, all training camp, it's it's an issue right now? Um, if if I knew the answer to that, we wouldn't have the problem. Um, you know, I, I I couldn't tell you. You know, teams. Something we all knew we were go ahead doing heading into the game. Um, we have a couple guys that hadn't played together, you know, a couple groups that hadn't played together. But that comes with uh, that comes with experience. Um, we just got to get better. The second quarter is, continues to be a problem. I mean, is there any kind of letdown, you know, after the first, or what do you any any ideas? Um, again, I mean, I can, I can only speak on this game, but right. you know, I thought I thought we did relax a little bit. You know, we felt comfortable and. Um, you know, let them walk into their shots, stop being physical with them defensively, and and uh, you know they got to run free. And anytime, and anytime an NBA team gets to run free, bad things happen. So we just gotta um, gotta keep tight. And that, that, that second quarter, um, that second quarter, we gotta fix it. All right, thanks, everybody. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Again. Mm -hmm.